Hey everybody, it is Ed. Okay, today's video, we're going to talk about a new release that is coming out from Music on Vinyl. And this looks like a treat if you don't own it already. However, if you do, it's questionable as to whether or not this is something that I'm going to actually pick up myself. But thought I'd let anybody who might be interested know regardless. So what are we talking about? Well, Music on Vinyl is going to reissue this box set. This was released, I believe this was 1970 or 71. Mm, can't remember offhand. I believe it was 1970. This four LP box set came out. And this is Elvis Worldwide 50 Gold Award Hits Volume 1. This was a four LP box set. And when this was initially released, it did come with a souvenir photo book. Which... Is right here all right inside now the thing that i particularly love about this release is that every song that is on here is a mono mix and again it's a 4lp set and it came with a little booklet and it came with a little flip open type box Okay, but from what I understand, the one that's coming out, I believe the box is going to be a little bit thicker. I might be wrong. And it's not going to be a, a box that you open up like this. From what I understand, you will be able to remove the whole lid off of the box as opposed to this one. I mean, unless, of course, the spine was ripped, then you would be able to lift uh, this off completely as well. However, this one still does seem to be intact. So I am not going to be doing that. All right, but 50 songs for LPs. Let me read you the press release. All right, so it says, uh, this was actually announced yesterday, June 27th, and I found this on ElvisNews.com. Worldwide 50 gold hits. Music on Vinyl announced the release for a box set, Elvis Presley Worldwide 50 Gold Award Hits Volume 1, with a 20-page photo album on gold, black, marble, vinyl on August 12th, 2022. And then all they do is, from there, they give you the track listings. Now, um, it does not specifically say... Oh, wait, it does. Well... On the picture that they show here, forgive the cracks in my screen, and it does show the cover, and the cover does show that it's going to be in mono. So if that is the case, and they use the actual master tapes that they use to produce this, which I kind of doubt that they are, but again, I don't know. Uh, for sure, I couldn't find anything else. The only thing I could find... Uh, was I believe it was a, a UK website that had a pre-order for this. And it looked like that the price was approximately 70 pounds, I believe it was. Uh, I'm not quite sure what that would equal in America. I believe that would be maybe $80, $85 in American money. Not exactly sure. But again, though, if you're talking four LPs, and it doesn't specifically state it, but if they are 180 gram LPs, colored vinyl and the box set and 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 the photo book included as well I, I that's what i was wondering how much is this thing going to cost i mean if a regular album at this point is going for 30 35 dollars you're going to multiply that times four and then have the box so you know i thought it was going to be maybe 100 120 dollars but i don't know i guess we're going to find out so now that begs the question would it be worth picking up at that much money i don't know that's up to you my personal opinion at this point would be I don't feel the need for myself to go and pick this particular version up once it is released. Why? Well, I have the original. I have my original mono mixes. I'm very happy with them. The albums are in very good condition. So there's really no reason for me to do an upgrade, especially, you know, for that amount of money. Uh, I just don't feel for me personally it would be worth it. However... If this is a box set that you do not have in your collection and it was something that you were looking to get, then maybe this might be a good opportunity for you to get this. But again, also makes me wonder that if you do not own this box set, would you probably be just better off finding an original set 
and and spending that money to have an original, which would probably wind up being cheaper uh, than this new release coming out by Music on Vinyl because, again, if you're going to find it used, and I mean, again, depending on condition, if it's in really good condition, I, I think you should be able to probably get an original box for less than $50, you know, even with the book. I could be wrong, but I don't know. So just food for thought. If you don't own it, would it be better off getting an original copy? That would be my two cents. However, you may feel differently. Let me know in the comments. Let me know what you think, if you would like. All right, but I appreciate you watching. Let me know if this is something that you may be interested in getting. If you own the original, or if you were going to get one, which would you get? Would you go out and find an original and, and get that one? Or would you pay to have the new pressing by Music on Vinyl? Tough choice. For me, I'm going to say it's a no-go. But again, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. All right? I appreciate you all watching. Hope everybody's doing well. Be good to yourselves. Be good to each other. And take care.